How to make a traditional baked Easter ham. If your culinary knowledge of ham is limited to sandwich lunch meat, this guide will show you how to turn that large hock into a beautiful holiday meal. You will need a ham, one cup brown sugar, two tablespoons mustard, quarter cup pineapple juice, and quarter cup cognac. Equipment, a roasting pan, a basting brush, and a serving platter. Step one, choose either a city ham, which is brined and smoked and has a mild flavor and moist texture, or a country ham, which is cured and aged for a more intense flavor, but drier texture. Step two, follow directions included with your city or country ham and bake at 325 to 350 degrees Fahrenheit in a deep roasting pan. Do not remove the outer foil unless instructed to do so. Fully cooked hams only need to be warmed through, but a partially cooked ham needs to reach an internal temperature of 148 degrees Fahrenheit. Step three, mix up the glaze by combining the brown sugar, mustard, pineapple juice, or the cognac in a small bowl. If you use cognac, you can leave out the pineapple juice. Step four, remove the ham about 30 minutes before the end of the cooking time. Remove the foil and apply about half of the glaze using a basting brush. Score the ham in a diamond pattern with a sharp knife, if it wasn't done already, to allow the glaze to penetrate. Step five, reduce the oven temperature to 300 degrees and continue baking the ham for another 30 minutes or until the glaze starts to caramelize and turn golden brown. Step six, remove the cooked ham and allow it to cool for five minutes. Baste with the remaining glaze before transferring it to a serving platter for your hungry family. Did you know? Northern Europeans during the 17th and 18th centuries ate ham in the spring because most fresh meat wasn't available, but cured meats like ham were more plentiful.